but I need to address something that you said in your prior question. What you were suggesting is that I needed to provide a different version of my report that would be fit for public release. That is nowhere in the rules. I was to prepare a confidential report that was comprehensive and thorough of an What is in the rules, the Mr. General. Herr, what is in the rules is you don't gratuitously do things to prejudice the subject of an investigation when you're declining to prosecute. You don't gratuitously add language that you know will be useful in a political campaign. You were not born yesterday. You understood exactly what you were doing. It was a choice. You certainly didn't have to include that language. You could have said vis-a-vis -vis the documents that were found at the university, the president did not recall. There is nothing more common, you know this, I know this, there is nothing more common with a witness of any age when asked about events that are years old to say, I do not recall. Indeed, they're instructed by their attorney to do that if they have any question about it. You understood that, you made a choice, that was a political choice, it was the wrong choice. Mr. Chairman, I yield back. Gentleman yields back. The gentleman from Arizona, did the did, did, uh, special counsel wish to respond to that final question? Y yes, Congressman. What you are suggesting is that I shape, sanitize, um, omit portions of my reasoning and explanation to the Attorney General for political reasons. No, I suggest and, that you and, and not shape your report for political reasons, which is, is what you did. That did not happen, response. Congressman. That did not happen. 